moving to the same spot. Embark on a fleet at a coast by moving onto it. This scroll contains your options for besieging enemy settlements. Left click on show me how for further details. Left click the maintain siege button to begin starving the enemy out. However, before following this course of action, you must consider that the settlement may have enough supplies to be able to survive for several turns before falling, or that the enemy may be reinforced by another army in that time. If you already have onagers in your army, then you can attack straight away. Settlement under siege, sir! It is important that you move swiftly to repel enemy armies when they invade your territory. If left standing in a region, an army will automatically inflict damage to the surrounding countryside, destroying roads, farms... Once a character or army is moving towards their target, you can double their speed with an additional left or right click on the target. Well done. You have freed the Tarquinii from tyranny. The Senate of Rome has voted to allow full citizenship to the Taquinii. You must now develop this settlement and put business in order. This will take less time if you do not enslave or exterminate a settlement. Now would be a good time to learn how to control the development of your settlements. By selecting and constructing the career. To keep this settlement safe and to support your troops, you need to improve Tarquinii's public order rating and your income. To do this, you must 1. Build a shrine to Jupiter to help keep the population happy. 2. Build better roads to increase trade and troop movement speeds. 3. Build at least 4 units of town watch to act as garrison. Although you will need to spend a few turns clicking the end turn button to achieve this, don't worry. You can spend this time exploring the scrolls and buttons on your control panel. There will be more action soon. This is the button you click for recruiting armies. No faction can survive without armies, and this is where you build them. You need to have the money and a population to recruit from. This group. The Senate are impressed with your progress. You must now take the Samnite city of Bovianum in the southeast. The Samnites have insulted the authority and dignity of Rome by supporting the Etruscan tyrant of Tarquinii in his resistance to Rome. They seem to prefer the company of Gauls and Greeks to the honest and upright people of Rome. To move your units out of a city, left-click on the city. Then left-click on the unit or agent in the review panel you wish to move out of the city. Hold down the control key when selecting more than... Manual recruitment can only take place when a governor is present in a settlement if there is no permanent governor. You have constructed a shrine to Jupiter. This will help increase Tarquinii's loyalty to Rome. Make sure you upgrade your barracks in order to allow recruitment of units. This will allow you to move existing troops out of Tarquinii and onto more important duties. You now have all the basics you need to manage a successful faction. Your only limits are your own ability and the whims of fate. You may wish to continue this campaign and steer your faction to dominance in Italy. You will still receive advice from time to time. Or you may want to move on to the Imperial campaign. As ever, the choice is yours. Roma Invicta. Manual construction can only take place when a governor is present in the settlement. If there is no...
Use backspace to stop the movement of your characters or armies on the campaign map. At this time, it would be a sound strategy to build stables in this settlement. This is the prerequisite for the recruitment of all cavalry units. Spacebar to speed up movement of all characters or armies on the campaign map. Press the spacebar again to slow them down again. General! Move depleted, sir! You have selected a target outside the green highlighted area. This means your character cannot reach his target this turn. Provided that an enemy does not block his path, your character will continue on his journey next turn. Red paths indicate the part of the journey that will take... You are entering the province of Umbria. Umbria and the town of Piscina are safely under the protection of Rome. You need not bother with any action in this area. March! It appears you have taken a wrong turn and are headed to the Samnut city. Of you should make sure you have a few siege weapons before you try and storm the... This scroll shows you details of the given general in your faction. The small panel at the top shows his rank, name and current skill levels. Beneath are listed his retinue, traits, and details of any mercenaries that are available for hire at the time. Engage the enemy! Besieging settlement, sir! Settlement under siege, sir! This scroll lets you view important information about your faction, including your progress through the game and battle statistics. In addition, you can globally alter... Left click on graphics op